timer flash seven times. BT system. You ain't testing, you're guessing. Hey, what's going on, everyone? It's me, Mikey Pipes. Didn't record much today, but went to this house in this video, and I saw this house being built maybe uh, maybe four or five years ago, and I've always, always wanted to take a peek inside of it. And I got a small, small little peek, as you'll see, coming up right now. Hope you enjoy. Uh, in summary, you know, it's every day is a learning adventure. And every day, you typically see something you haven't seen before. And it's not always the navings that are leaking. It's not always, you know, the bad TXVs on the air handlers or low refrigerant or dirty filters. But every so often, you know, I run a plumbing call. And on this one, they got a, uh, a Kohler shower valve. Let's see what valve it is. What valve did they tell me they said it was? Hmm. Hold on. I don't know. It's a weird one, but I never saw one like this before. Three quarter, and they have a half inch uh, transfer valve as well. And very little flow coming out of the shower head and handheld. So stay tuned. Check it no, out. No, this is not a Rocco job. This is though, I've wanted to go to this house since I saw them build it. Check this out, guys. Let me grab my iPad. No, but I'm sure if I'm... Yeah, no, we don't need measure. Look at this house, guys. Sick. It's the Taj Mahal. Now, the guy said go to the side door, but let's just walk to the front door anyway. Wow. Side door. Uh, I guess this way. Side door, side door, side door. Oh, well, it's the Taj Mahal. Love it. Look at this. Looks like I'm in LA somewhere. We're looking for the side door, but look at this. The Taj Mahal with Goodman. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and two Fujitsus. <laughs> look at this place. Oh, look at this. Isn't that disgusting? I would be ashamed of myself. All right. Gotta love the brushed gold finish, wall mounted. It's probably a coal or maybe a growy. I'm gonna guess it's coal because the problem is weak pressure, actually weak volume. There's our thermostatic control. And here is your diverter and volume control, probably. Let's see what happens. Nothing. Nothing coming out. Let's see what's going on. I wonder if it's the volume control. or thermostatic control. Let's check out the pressure at the sinks. You know, it's not that great here either. Let's check out the other. Eh. See that? Eh. Wasn't expecting this. Now, were you? <laughs> you weren't expecting this kind of bathroom, huh? This is decent. Let's check another fixture. Somewhere. Let's check the kitchen. Kitchen is great pressure. But not upstairs. All right. I'm going to take some Allen keys and take that out. Loosen up that set screw. And this one, carefully take this off. We're gonna set that over there. That's the one I needed. All right, now, 
this spins. See? That spins off. This ring there holds that in. <sighs> Let's see. Am I get a Phillips screwdriver? All right. You guys are gonna think I'm nuts. But there's a tool that goes in here. See, because there's a slot there, there's a slot there. They're gonna think I'm nuts. I'm gonna kneel those. <clears throat> Gotta be very, very careful with that. I ain't paying for new trim. My key pipes ain't doing it. Be very, very careful. Yes. Yeah, he definitely two hands for this. Let's see if I could get in there. Just about. Can't. No. Flash screwdriver. Let me get a little creative here. Let's see if I can be very, very careful. This trim is probably about 500 bucks. Yeah. See, cooler. Bam. Let's put that down. Let's. I'm gonna guess they silicone that down too, probably. What do you think? Yeah. It's hot in here. Yeah. The pipe doctor is hot. No, they didn't silicone it. Not lose that little spindle thingy. All right. Now there is our thermostatic valve, and there's a shut off here and a shut off there. We should be able to close this. Like that. And like that. Someone already broke this one, it looks like. And now, if I. But we're gonna be even smarter. Mm -hmm. We are gonna turn off the main water. This is going to be a little tricky. This is going to be a little tricky. We need to get a towel. Copy. All right. All right. I got a towel here. I'm going to loosen up these and see if we don't have that much water present. Just want to loosen it up a little bit. Nothing yet. I am relying on those plastic valves. That they're working. down there. You see a drip from the bottom? Mm -hmm. All right. She's still dripping over there. I want to use the towel to absorb the water we are on a second floor. Mm -hmm. And it looks 
like just about stopped. She's still dripping. We gotta turn off the water to the house because I don't want to risk property damage. screw want to come out. I'm just shoving that in there mm -hmm. in case the screw falls. Yeah, At to. least, you know, it's yeah. maybe on top of the towel. Say something is better than nothing, right? Mm -hmm. All right. The problem here is that I really can't test flow. See that appears to be closed still. Let me see that for a second. Take a look at that valve. See, that's closed. There's no pass through there, let's see. See, the valve, the ball in there, wasn't this orientation to begin with. Maybe they never just had it the right way. Really? Let's look on the other side. See if I can show this right in there and show you. Let me zoom out. Where is it? It's that one. And it's closed. See? Let's see something. Let's see if my theory is correct. Hmm. Doesn't. Hmm. Okay. I'm wrong. It says remove before soldering. And a number. Let's Google the number. It's me! It's me! Mikey Pipes. I must love hearing myself talk. Anyway. In the Taj Mahal. I'm in the Taj Mahal. That's right. where I belong. Right. Seriously. <laughs> As a plumber who's been doing this for quite some time. I should have a Taj Mahal, and I do have one. And I know you guys are gonna hate and thumbs down, but hate all you want. Hate all you want. Say command Z to hate. <laughs> okay. Since, by the way, this is a model 8304 mm -hmm. Kohler valve. This is a thermostatic cartridge. And all it does is adjust uh, temperature. Mm -hmm. Now, if you're not using a tub, in this case, we're not. As you can see, I'm in a relatively small shower. 
It's kind of pathetic, actually, but it's telling like it is, right? And Rocco, if you're watching this, because you're the contractor who sent me here to fix your fuck up, <laughs> you guys need to read the manual. Yeah. If you're not using tub, there's an aspirator inside here. And look at all the ports. See, there's one there, there's one there, there's one there, there and there, right? So there's one, two, three, four. There's four of them, yep. right? And there's cold, mm -hmm. right? And that would be naturally hot. Mm -hmm. That says Kohler, which would probably be the bottom. Yep. And if you look on top right here, you pull this out. Looks like a pen cap, yeah. right? You know where this goes? Basura. Oh. Basura, Aki. Not Home Depot. Not Home Depot buckets. Yep. So now... We are going to very carefully reassemble this bitch. All right. Okay. And then we'll turn the water back on. He never answered the question, the Kohler guy, about the position of the valves. But mm. we'll figure it out. Stay Probably. tuned. I did it all while having the big black thing in my mouth. <laughs> Might right. be pipes like cigars. Godzilla, you're gonna go downstairs uh -huh. and open the water. Copy. What the fuck is this? <laughs> it's better than it was before though. Oh, that's what damn said. I think my dog pees more than that. Alright, obviously problem is not solved. Got the water off. Let's dig deeper. What's crazy is Kohler actually had the balls to tell me. Mm -hmm. Oh, you piped it in with half inch pecs. And I'm like, hold on. First of all, you piped it in. Let's get the record straight. I did not install that mess there. Mm -hmm. All right. I want you guys to see this coming. And then I go on to tell her, Kohler, mm -hmm. that is on the phone, that there are millions of half-inch shower bodies installed. Millions of them. Yep. And that put easily put out over two gallons of water per minute. Mm -hmm. This one does maybe a quarter gallon per minute, if that, if it's lucky, on a good day. Guys, you gotta see this. We, I, I specifically pulled over the side of the road so you can see what's going on right here. Watch this. It's a parrot. Wait, wait for it. I'm gonna discreetly try to get it. The parrot. Where is it? It's a parrot. Is that a parrot? Yeah. Look at that! Oh my god, it's a parrot! That's crazy. You're walking the parrot. Yeah. <laughs> That's so cool. That is so cool. Oh, that is so cool. He's going for a walk. Look at that, guys. The parrot's going for a walk. But his mom and grandma, look at that. Good for you, ladies. That's awesome. <laughs> now you've seen it all.